And just a clap, please. Hey Singapore, this is Hong, and this is The Breakdown. lyrics let's just say the world ended a week from now what would you do question one how did the idea for this song start the idea for this song sparked um out of thin air really oh, magic i mean it's i wish it was more interesting um it was pre-pandemic so it was nothing to do with that we were in la yeah in the studio you were in a booth by yourself yeah crouched over your laptop we do have a history of predicting the future. Um, in 2017, we wrote a song called Shrink with the lyric. You'd better book me a shrink for 2020. Cause about that time I'm gonna be crazy, crazy. And look at what happened. So, just saying, well, let's say pack your bags because the world could end in seven days. You need to get to the moon ASAP. <laughs> Question two. Does the idea of the world ending scare you and why? Me personally, no. Because you just gotta live every day as if it was your last. Oh, this? Uh -huh. That's my credo, no regrets. So you just gotta have fun and not be too serious and and you'd all be in it together, wouldn't you? That's true. true. I'd rather, knowing that everyone was in it together would be quite reassuring, I think. We'll lose. And we'll do that together too. Um, and the other thing is, it depends how the world is ending. I would be nervous if it was something really brutal. Or less nervous if I knew it was just going to be exist, exist, exist. And then one day nobody wakes up again. You know what I mean? Yeah, like what? Me too. Yeah, whereas like if it's like in seven days, so like some massive creature is going to come down, and like gobble everyone up really slowly and painfully. Run! It's Godzilla! That's why climate change is crucial because you don't want to be sat here whilst you roast alive, like no, and get loads of awful illnesses and stuff. Yeah. So go recycle, electric recycle, and turn your lights off. Yes, and your TV off, standby, and fully off. If there was a vessel, or yeah. Vessel, yeah. would you get on it, and who would you bring with you? <clears throat> okay, it depends who's driving the vessel. Look at me, sure. I'm the captain now. Yeah, if it's um, Jason Statham or The Rock. I will beat your ass like a Cherokee drum. When you get on it. Yeah, because they're going to drive like hell. <laughs> <laughs> the Rock! Is he, is he in Too Fast Too Furious? Oh, probably. I don't know, I'm just making stuff Yeah, up. we've got nods. It depends. If it was like a few... How many people are going? Because if it's like 10 people going, there's a lot of questions. I'd need a lot of things clarified before I could make a decision. First off, who are you? <laughs> and I don't think I'd be the first person to be asked. I, either. We need a bit of entertainment on the new planet. <laughs> Next question, please. <laughs> so these are about the lyrics. Nothing left to lose, nothing else to prove. What would you do? Question one. So what would each of you do personally? I think the main thing, like the reality is, I just want to hang out with my family, I think. You'd eat That's whatever, whatever you want. Eat whatever oh you want. yeah, that would be liberating. I'd get all the takeaways. Yeah. Pizza, pasta. All the sushi, katsu curry. All the shaolong bao, bao buns, and satay chicken, and oh god, lord help me. I'm a wreck. All I've been doing is eating, and I'll probably eat all night. <laughs> is there something you would have done differently if the world was going to end? Partly because of the fact that we've managed to make our lives home and we've both got nice partners. We're very happy with our, like we got really well with our family. I I don't think I'd die without any. With no regrets. I think I'd die with no regrets. No regrets? I don't think I've been horrible to anyone. You? What about? Shut up now, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. What is one thing you would do if there were no consequences? Eat Nutella all the time. Chocolate? 
chocolate! Every meal, every snack. Every, Brush your teeth with it. Yeah, every drink. Just put a bit of water in it and make it into... Mix it with that. <laughs> yeah, I think eating would be like the big the big thing where you just go hard and you for the last week. Yeah. Nothing left to lose. What's something you would never do even if the world was ending? I murder someone. Well, I can't say that visual. Sure. But yeah, I mean, no, I wouldn't. But I you never, never know how you'd react if someone did something awful to your whole family. True. Or if they were just me. about to kill you. What are you doing? Who, me? <laughs> no, well, no, me. Oh. But if someone was coming me. at you. All right. I would never, I hate spiders, so I'd never, still would never go anywhere near a spider. <laughs> if you had one week left to live. I would never touch a spider. Oh, if, yeah. <laughs> That's the most random thing I've ever heard. Thank you. Very good. <laughs> Guys, thanks Thank for, you watching for watching us. us. Today. <laughs> All the best and kind regards. James and Andy from Hong.